Saltwater crocodiles, also known as salties, are the largest living reptiles on Earth. Males can grow up to 23 feet in length and weigh over 2,200 pounds. These massive predators are found primarily in the coastal areas of Southeast Asia, Northern Australia, and the eastern coast of India. Saltwater crocodiles are known for their adaptability, being able to live in both freshwater and saltwater environments thanks to their lingual salt glands that filter out salt. They have powerful jaws capable of exerting immense force, making them formidable hunters. Salties are opportunistic feeders, preying on fish, birds, mammals, and occasionally other reptiles. They are highly territorial and can travel long distances in search of food and suitable habitat. The Amazon is a vast and biodiverse ecosystem, spanning several countries in South America. It is home to a variety of crocodilian species, with the black caiman being the largest and most dominant. Black caimans can grow up to 16 feet in length and are known for their dark coloration. In addition to the black caiman, the Amazon houses several smaller caiman species, such as the spectacled caiman and the dwarf caiman. These crocodilians play crucial roles in the ecosystem by maintaining the balance of fish and other aquatic species populations. Given their adaptability and resilience, saltwater crocodiles would likely thrive in the Amazon's rich and diverse environment. The abundance of prey and suitable habitats would provide ample opportunities for these predators. Saltwater crocodiles are known for their ability to adapt to various environments. In the Amazon, they would find a perfect habitat with plenty of food sources, including fish, birds, mammals, and even other crocodilians. Their ability to live in both freshwater and saltwater gives them an edge in exploring the extensive waterways of the Amazon. The presence of saltwater crocodiles would inevitably lead to competition with the native black caimans. While black caimans are formidable predators, saltwater crocodiles are larger and stronger, giving them a competitive advantage. This could lead to direct conflicts and possibly a shift in the dominance of the ecosystem. Introducing a new apex predator like the saltwater crocodile would have significant ecological impact. These crocodiles would likely dominate the food chain, preying on a wide range of animals, including those currently hunted by black caimans. This could lead to a decline in populations of certain prey species, disrupting the natural balance of the ecosystem. The introduction of saltwater crocodiles could pose a threat to native species, particularly the smaller caimans and other aquatic animals. The increased competition for food and habitat could lead to a decline in their populations. Additionally, the presence of a larger predator could alter the behavior and distribution of prey species, leading to further ecological changes. If saltwater crocodiles were to establish themselves in the Amazon, they would likely become the new apex predator. Their size, strength, and adaptability would allow them to outcompete black caimans and other predators. This could lead to a reshuffling of the ecosystem with saltwater crocodiles taking over many of the roles currently filled by black caimans. The Amazon rainforest is teeming with potential prey for saltwater crocodiles. From large fish and birds to mammals like tapirs and capybaras, there would be no shortage of food sources. Even larger predators like jaguars could become targets for these formidable crocodiles. While saltwater crocodiles would likely dominate in direct confrontations with black caimans, the competition dynamics could be complex. The two species might carve out different niches within the ecosystem, with saltwater crocodiles occupying larger waterways and black caimans adapting to smaller habitats. However, the larger and more aggressive nature of saltwater crocodiles would likely give them an overall advantage. Saltwater crocodiles are highly territorial and would establish territories within the vast waterways of the Amazon. Their territorial nature could lead to conflicts with other crocodilians, but their size and strength would likely allow them to dominate these encounters. Saltwater crocodiles are prolific breeders, with females laying large clutches of eggs. This reproductive success would aid in their establishment and expansion within the Amazon. Their nests, typically built on riverbanks, would be well suited to the Amazon's environment. The tropical climate of the Amazon would be favorable for saltwater crocodiles. Their ability to regulate their body temperature and adapt to different water conditions would allow them to thrive in this environment. The rich biodiversity of the Amazon would provide ample opportunities for foraging and nesting. These adaptable and powerful predators would likely outcompete native species, disrupt the natural balance of the ecosystem, and pose a threat to the biodiversity of the Amazon. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or topics you'd like me to cover in future videos, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, stay wild and keep exploring.